Hey guys, I'm the French Golf. If you're new to the channel, we're here to provide you with entertaining and compelling golf content uh, and be a little bit on the fringe about it. So we're out here at Cypress Lakes today in uh, Cypress, Texas. We're gonna get an 18 hole vlog in. Boys, are you ready? Let's do it. I was born ready, man. I told you this. <laughs> this guy's talking all this trash. It's going down. I'm about, I'm about to back it up on the course. Yep. Watch, watch this. We'll see what happens. Let's get it, boys. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell. That's what all the cool kids are doing. Uh, so I pulled my tee shot over there to the left. Um, that is not where you want to be. The hole is tucked behind those trees, and I am what you call tree jail over there. Justin with a good one down the middle. Nothing new there. Eric Flair joining us for the round today. Puts one over in tree jail right. So plenty of tree action here. As you can see, I am boned i'm um, just trying to get something over the trees and i thin it comes out low but it ends up on the green We're far far putt but i'm on the green i'm dancing there's eric hiding behind the tree playing peekaboo on the course and a good punch out oh that was actually a good shot he got a good look at the birdie Justin trying to put one in tight. He's got a birdie look. She's dancing. She's dancing. Oh, Eric, how'd that shot feel? Man, great, man. It was uh, a little long, but man, for where I was to have a shot at par, I'm good. Did you get lucky? Did you get lucky? Absolutely not, man. That was, ex <laughs> that was skill. <laughs> skill. Skill. <laughs> Nokia over there with his damn lies. Justin, looking to get started. With a long, long birdie. Not quite. Good putt, though. Eric Flair with the bomb. Birdie, baby. Cuckoo! Boy, it came to play today. Came to play today. I ain't driving Look two hours at for nothing. Came to play today. <laughs> that would be the best putt I make today. Nice putt. Hmm. Walked it in. Walk it That's in. What happens when you fail at walking it in? <laughs> Yay, golf guy. Hey, you know what? Man? We're, we're here with on the fringe uh, video and golf today. These guys are cool. Y'all should join this site. I'm going to post this on my site so all you golfers can go over to that site. That's and, what I'm talking about. Uh, y'all need to post this on Dude. Where's my park? Oh yeah, DWMP. That's it. Three ten all day, pheasant bitches. <laughs> Dude, where's my birdie? <laughs> There's a shout out to Dude Where's My Par Facebook page. Got a lot of fun golf content on there. If you haven't checked it out, um, go get on there. That's a lot of fun. If you cannot handle trash talk, do not go check it out. I'm just warning you now. Um, so this is, a, as you can tell from the satellite photo, you cannot miss left, you cannot miss right. This is probably one of the toughest holes on this course. Um, but it's a par five, so everybody takes a driver and gives it hell. I had a good tee shot there. I'm just about 40 yards behind everyone else. I've got 250 to the flag. I don't want to put any risk in here. I'll try and play some stress-free golf. Put it to about 100 yards. From the I got your wuss right here. Center of the fairway. Eric Flair with a good layup, we think. Right in between. Well, I can't see it. I lost that a little to the right, but it should be okay, I hope. All right, actually got 85 yards in. I'm gonna take a little three quarter gap wedge and try and get it close. There's a tiny tree in the way. They are 75% air. So really not anything to worry about here. Just get the ball up on the green. Give myself a birdie putt. A little tug job. Left hand side of the green. 
Eric Flair, after that birdie on one, trying to put himself in a good position for another one. Oh, yeah. Good layup, Zach. Not quite. Got another 10-footer coming back down to save par. Justin with a great bunker shot. Go in. Oh. Give me Eric Flair. Forgot he put one in the water off the tee. But he saves with a beautiful oh, par putt. Oh, man. And I just don't know what I was looking at there. Didn't move at all. Straight as an arrow. There he is. Big man Jay Rich with the birdie. Here we go to number three. It's also a very tough hole. You do not need driver off the tee. Um, just takes a three wood. And there's a bunker there. We'll see where that ended up. Eric Flair. Ouch. Stay up. That ought to be a fun part. <laughs> Ouch. Tried to prank that so as I said, there. you don't need driver. Oh. Oh, no. That one is gone fishing. Touch them all, big boy is right. We're doing something about, though. Doing something about that, though. I'm trying to lose some weight. I don't need big, big boy anymore. However, I hit a great gapper here, just short of the green. All right, game management as fine as I pulled three wood because I knew I couldn't reach this bunker if I pulled it over here. What can I say? It's a thinking man's game. Trying to back up the birdie on two. These tailor-made P790s. I'm still trying to get used to the yardage I've gained. It's ridiculous. Oh. Right, right, Justin. It's the P790s. Oh, get down. Big bounce, running out. All right, got a putt at it. Trying to save that par. Oh, hum, easy chip. Let's go to number four. Come on, boys. Let's go. Nothing to it. Easy bogey. Jay Rich trying to go back to back here. It's kind of a tough spot. Now Cypress Lake's a little bit about the course. Um, the the greens were punched about a week and a half before we played it, so when you see them, they're they're still a little bumpy there in spots. It's in great shape. Oh, he on fire! Number four. This is a longish par three. We're playing it straight into the wind that day. It was about a probably about a two club wind. And we all struggled with that, picking the right club. I think all three of us ended up short here. Um, I hit a great one, but it just got an unlucky bounce and kicked into the bunker. And our man, Eric Flair, he flared it over to the left. So he has some work to get up and down. Coming out of the beach, I hit a great spot on the, the fringe. I just couldn't get it to bite, so it ran out to about you know, 15, 20 feet. There's a good angle. Look at that professional photography we're doing. Get up there. Get up! Trying to save par. Camera's in your face. Oh, not that putt, though. Jay Rich to save his par here. Oh, no. Not that side of the hole, Jay Rich. All right, so um, here's a cool little hole. There's water up there about, I think it's about 230, 240. Um, so Air Flair took a, a three wood off the tee so that he couldn't reach it. Prime position. Jay Rich kind of flared his out to the right. Um, stuck behind some trees, but we'll see if we can't make that work. And we call this a smoke show, folks. That is going to be right down the center. Give myself a wedge in. And I uh, definitely brought water into play, but guess what? I'm fine. All right, got to go under some trees, over another, and then over some water, and then land by the flag. Here we go. Oh, squirrel. Where'd it go, Jay Rich? I don't know. I don't know where it went. Didn't go in the water. So Eric Flair trying to give himself a shot at a birdie here. Just gets it on the front side of the green. Good shot. All right, here's a good chance for birdie here. 110 to the stick, a little downwind. Birdie, birdie calling. Let's go. No, go in the hole, get a big birdie. A little 
little saucy sauce. That should be good, man. Ten feet. Jay Rich looking to save his par. Get this one close and put it in far. Get all over it. Get all over it. Just on the fringe. Shout out to your boys. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. And Eric Flair again going for that birdie here online. Oh, amateur side. This is my best shot at a birdie all day. And I wasn't even close. Don't go in that bunker. You show a shit going bogey. <laughs> no, I don't even see it. I see that bunker. <laughs> it's big. Don't worry about the bunker, guys. I will just poof this one uh, down the fairway about 100 yards. So just short of that bunker. No issues there. Eric Flair, he took it at the bunker, but he hooked it around to a great spot in the middle of the fairway. That's a good ball right there. Jay Rich, um, he flares that out to the right. I might as well call him Jay Flair. That's two or three holes in a row. What are you doing? I hit that gapper terribly. I'm going to try this again. Let's see if we can't get this close. You know, normally I love this golf club. On this hole, I did not. You can actually watch that. Yeah, worm burner for days. Did not get it close. We'll be trying to get up and down for par. Now, this shot right here was money. When I hit it, it looked good. It was all over it. And I think it ended about five feet or so. Justin from over on the right-hand side, trying to get himself in position for another birdie. It's going to be a little bit long just on the fringe, but it's a back pin, so it's a good spot. Eric Flair looking for a long birdie bomb. Can we get a birdie bomb? No. What's the plumb bob say? He doesn't know what the fucking plumb bob says. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Atta boy. Lucky guess. That is a birdie bomb, folks. So, birdie boy steps up to the tee here. This one was playing into the wind as well. We were playing about, if I remember correctly, about 190 yards into the wind. Ooh, let me show you all this. Jay Rich loves him some Jay Rich. Nothing wrong with that. He's a good player sometimes. Uh, this one, go in the hole. Is that in the hole? <laughs> Stay tuned to find out. <laughs> Very well might have gone in the hole. You have to check it out and see for yourself. Eric Flair just kind of dumps one out to the right-hand side of the green. He's going to try and get up and down for his par here. This has a nasty green that slopes pretty hard from the right to left towards the water. So where Jay Rich is here, it's fast. It's coming. And that's great speed from where he was. Very nice. See, that's what he's pointing at. It's going that way. It's going that way. Can we get a birdie bomb? No. No, we can't. God forbid I make a short birdie putt. So uh, Jay Rich does what Jay Rich does. Smoked right down the center. Smoked. That was hammered. Hammered is right. <laughs> Snappy snap. That's a snap snap oh, to the left. Sit. sit. You better listen to him. Learned that one from Alex. I don't know. Eric Flair smashes one. He's going to be in great position. Par five here. So both of them are going to have a good shot at getting to the green. I mean, it's not going to be as long as mine, but, you know. I try to play a big old hook, and it just wouldn't hook for me. So I go from one side of the trees to the other side of the trees. Hey, at least it didn't go in the water. Well, Eric was trying to hook it around the trees as well, and that just kind of killed a couple worms there. Now, Jay Rich... He had a great opportunity, had a long iron in to par five, get himself on the green, and it just didn't happen. Now I've always been told, don't compound one error by trying to force the second shot. But I'm not one for philosophy, so I'm gonna go ahead and force this second shot. Let's go. Yeah, 
I mean, philosophy is dumb anyways. What does Descartes really even know? Uh, I thinned the hell out of a wedge. Could have been worse. Yeah, good point, Zach. This is future Zach telling then Zach. Good point. Get tight, get tight, get it right. There goes Jay Rich. Trying to set up a birdie putt. Look at that zoom. Whoa, it's grainy. All right, let's save that bogey. Here we go. Drop. Doing my best to shambo. What was that excuse? It hit what? It was a dot right there. Oh, it hit the grass? That grass? Yeah. You guys should see that dot. That dot was nasty. Another birdie bomb. There it is. Atta boy, Jay Rich. Gets it to eat. Oh, Pipe City. Pipe City. Somebody call the police, the pipes. The first. I had every intention on doing it, but... Then we all be slow, but then we got to get another ball. Oh! Yeah. What is this, a long drive competition? Let's go, Break boys. That we follow that Let's go. Oh, I got you. Mashed hey, potatoes! Oh, oh, my God. Pipe City! <laughs> Drops the mic. Mic drop, baby. Let's go. I have cool name, like Zach. No way I can mess this up, guys. See, I had a great drive. No way it's gonna, oh, yeah. It didn't make the green. Eric Flair, definitely not his best effort either. But he challenged Jay Rich and you'll see what happens. Great <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Oh. Oh. Okay. I wonder what it's like to be good at golf to be able to do stuff like that. That's good enough for me. That's good enough for you. No. Guys. He's giving it oh, to me. Oh, I would not have given that to him. Oh. He's giving it to me. I'll take it. I wouldn't have missed that. You know that. You gotta earn your birdies. I don't care if it's two inches. You gotta make that birdie. Unlike whatever the hell that was, I just displayed there. Good hit, Susan. All right. Well, let's get a birdie bomb here to close it. Eric Flair, come on. No. All right. Well, check us out in part two. Thank you again for joining us, Cypress Lakes. Uh, this is part one of oh, our I series. That's good. Another gift of a <laughs> gimme there uh, from the boys. But uh, thank you again for watching. Hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed what you saw. And we'll see you next time. Forever, eternally, an aid handicap. Ah. Uh. Nah, man, you just gotta work on it. I'm the, I have the mental capacity of a five-year-old. <laughs>